Major Slack Attack. Boy, well, yeah, the name is Slack. Thanks for coming back. Let's walk through some more Skyrim and the Seven Trials of Tamriel. We're approaching trial number six, which I'm going to call the Giant Trial by Fire. And this is going to be a doozy. We're going to have to do a lot of prep for this. Uh, we just finished the Bleak Falls Boxer. Let's uh, put on our running around town gear. Should have some fur armor in here somewhere. Yeah, that looks great. And you can get rid of that shield. And off to our left here, as soon as you exit the false barrel, there's always a random potion. You pick that up. Next, off to the Guardian Stones that we're going to activate the Thief Stone. And now we're going to make our way to Riverwood, but on our way there, um, I want to collect at least one more Tapanella. So if you just take the river here. Take your cat for a little swim. Cats love water. Don't you know? <laughs> and there's always a log here with some more tapanella there. There we go. There's our more tapanella. And are there some wolves nearby? Can we fast travel? Yes, we can. Great. Okay. Into river would we go? Uh, the reforming the dawn god. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, we want to talk to... Actually, Fangdale will do. Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. Maybe... Never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. Actually, I think it's better if we talk to Sven. Um, we'll do that later. Alvor! Make sure we got our amulet Zenithar on, get better prices, and let's offload. Lighten the load, because we are close to being maxed out, and we need some money. If... You don't have the Dongar DLC. Save all your arrows for something very important later on. If you do have the Dongar DLC, don't worry about it. sell it. Sell everything. I have the Dongar DLC. Don't need any of this. And let's just offload all this armor. And he is out of gold. Good day. Good day. Next. What we should do is go talk to Sven first, who should be at the inn. And he's not here while we're waiting. Let's just go loot this fish barrel, see if we can get some salt pile. Should show up pretty soon. There he is, Sven. You look like a traveler. So and you places and look like stories. a total wuss who's afraid to hit on the local pretty girl. What's up with that? Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. Uh huh. Okay. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak. You don't say. All right. Around. He's wasting his time. What are you gonna do about it? You may be right. Camilla may see Feindel as here. Give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. That's it's a good idea. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Uh, what else are we doing here? Uh, I think that's about it. Now, let's go to the river with Trader. Lots of business to take care of here. First of all, let's do a little caper with Camilla. You're Camilla. Strapping young man. I have a letter from Feindel. From Feindel? Yep. That's strange. He's never written to me before. Well, that's nothing to be what, suspicious what about. What is this? Is this what he really thinks about me? Well, you can tell that... that long-eared ass not to come around the store anymore. He's not welcome. I'd better get going. <laughs> long-eared ass. <laughs> okay, Lucan. My sister Camilla or I will be happy to help you. Yeah, that's nice. Did something happen here? Uh, Looks like there's yeah, an empty spot on the counter here. A bit of a, a break-in. A break-in? Oh, okay. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. And what was that? An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You know, say. Well, I just happen to have one of these in my possession. You found it? Yeah. <laughs> there it is! Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? Fancies. I'm going to put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. Subtle You've done a great thing accusations. for me and my sister. All right, so... 
time for a major slack tradition after uh, bringing so back the golden claw. claw back where it belongs. Yes. Thank you. Luke, can come upstairs. I want you out of the way temporarily. Come on up. Atta boy. Okay, now time for a major slack tradition. Attempt to bump the golden claw into the basket. Out of the way, Camilla. Come on. Stop sweeping. Sit down. Wouldn't you know it. <laughs> I got a little trouble. Okay, let's just wait an hour and see if we can get Camilla to take lunch break. Okay, she took lunch break. There you go. Okay, come on upstairs, Lincoln. I just did one in a practice front. It was beautiful. It rebounded off the back wall and went right in the basket. It was, it was beautiful. I even recorded it. Upstairs, Lucan. <whistles> Come on. I'm stealing something. There we go. Okay. All right. Can he get the golden claw into the basket? Uh, Leo. It means so much to us. Go! Thank you. Have you seen these people? He does it. Ha <laughs> ha. Excellent. It's a fine day with you around. I think that calls for Mr. Burns. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Burns. All right. Um, and we have a few more things to sell. Thank you so much for trinkets, odds and ends. I couldn't. Even, I was so stunned that I got it. I couldn't even believe it. It took me a while to react. <laughs> okay. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. This is spare. And we can sell on the scroll and some books that we don't need. Don't need that. The werewolf books we don't need. The thief book and all these gems here. Don't need that. That might be useful. Or not. <laughs> okay, what's a carry weight? Carry right, weight yeah. is 91. Beautiful. Okay, great. Oh, hold up here. Hold up. One more thing. Let's collect these three Ida Cheese wheels and one of these potions here. At least one healing potion. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Frost Miriam and a couple garlics. What? What you doing? Do you have money Riverwood left? Trader. Oh, a bit of this. You do have money yeah. left. Yeah, I knew there was something I forgot to sell. Keep at least one healing potion. Like a cheap one. Sell everything else. And that's it, you're out of money. Till next time. Done and done. Till next time. Um let's go to our headquarters in White Run. Get straightened out. On board, everybody should have a bunch of glowing mushroom. And that more tabanella that we just grabbed. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Okay, yet let's yank out the war hammer and the iron hand gauntlets. That'll work. All the ingredients go in. Okay, I'm just being like methodical. And we're going to yank out 10 glowing mushroom. Make that 15. Let's take them all. 15. And take out 6 in stool. I don't think we have any canis root, but we're going to get some soon. And all the death bell we can muster up. Any salt pile we man it might happen to have, and looks good to me. Bleeding ground. Do we need that? No, we do not. Okay. We'll drive out the yes. And restore water. That's it. 
with those ingredients on board. Any death bell you have, glowing mushroom, six imp stool, and any salt ball you have. And the steel warhammer, let's go to Windhelm. In Windhelm, the first thing we're going to do is take this little alley down here and grab this light armor skill book. Level up a bit. Check these barrels for salt pile. No luck. Back to the stables. Make sure it's after dark. After 10 at least. And we're going to ride into Windhelm. Okay, so we have visited Windhelm officially for the first time. Let's go back to the stables. What are you doing, Slack? Yeah, you'll find out later. You have to do this, though. You have to do exactly what I'm doing. Next, um... I didn't know why I went back to the stables. We've already discovered Riften. So, let's go to Riften Stables. As soon as you touch down, check these barrels here for some salt pile. There we go. And the third one's always empty. Go around the back of the stable house and get yourself one canis root. Go along the edge of the hillside here. Look behind this bush here and get your second canis root. Keep following the the rocks here along the left side. Follow around. Get the third cane is root. Go up behind this guardhouse here. And we're gonna get up on the cliff side here. Could be some wolves back here. Let's just get ready just in case the game gets cheeky, tries to instantly kill me. Alright, following along the cliff side here. Canis root number four. Canis root number five. Double back to the guardhouse. Just recharge some stamina. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, here we go. And Canis root number six. That's it. Rift in. This is, by the way, a level 13 challenge, okay? You're aiming to get to level 13, I'm presuming everyone is at level 12, you've been following these challenges and the rules of engagement very closely, and you don't have any perk points, any spare perk points to spend. Huh? Let's talk to Shatter, what, what kind want? of trouble are you in? I owe a great deal of money to someone and I think they cheated me. That's too bad. I don't know what to do. I was able to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and uh -huh. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire. You don't say. Now Sapphire wants her money wants back. Her money if back. I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. Well, that sucks to be you, eh? Okay, no, listen, I'll help you pay off your debt. You will? Yeah. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Be careful with Sapphire. That's she what we do. Okay, stop talking now. Alright, let's go into the bean barb. Before you do anything else, People let's rent a room and get the rest of bonus. The Strike that. The well rest of bonus. Got the coin. One room, sure please. Thing. It's yours for a day. Come yeah. back and see us again. The signs that Lady Mara is and your constant inebriation. Yeah. Say What's something bitchy. Flagons filled with your vile limbs <laughs> and embrace the teachings of the handmaiden of Kai. No, no. Uh, let's get the rest of bonus. Well rested bonus, rather. Back downstairs, let's talk to 
certainly we can come to some sort of an Sapphire. understanding. Yeah. Want to talk to the Shadow's dead? I knew that stupid kid would try and find a way to look. This is really simple. I lent him some gold, he promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. Okay, listen, you and I both know this is a setup. All right, all right. Level of speech. I guess I made enough from his shipment. Yeah. No need to waste any more time. Just okay, let's start, start the frost quest to get some more speech leveling with Louis Latresh. Louis Latresh. Want us to deliver a message? What sort of message? Ah, well, I recently okay, we re don't really need to do the, know the details. We don't care. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Talk to Sibby. Got it. You to bring me f Sounds easy Good. enough. Head to the Rift and Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Rift. Okay, quiet now. We want to leave. Okay, there we go. Out we go. Once again, just doing that to get the speech leveling from all the people we have to talk to in that quest. Around the corner here, over to the Blackbriar Meadery. Let's talk to Ungrian, who's always at the counter. Ungrian, tell us what a wonderful person Maven Blackbriar is. She's an absolute pleasure to work for. There we go. In fact, I almost feel guilty accepting pay from her. That's a nice sucking up. Commenting to my fellow Meadery workers just how lucky we are to be working for such a charitable family. Okay, it's a wonder she doesn't have cancer with all the smoke you're blowing up her ass. Um. <laughs> okay, listen, uh, why don't you tell me the truth? Okay, look, if I'm caught saying anything bad about the meadery or the family, I'm a dead man. I'm the fourth person to work the tasting counter in the last year. The last three are at the bottom of Lake Honrick. Just take my advice. Okay, that wasn't enough to love love speech, but it probably got us pretty close to the next level. Yeah, just a tad short. Okay, so let's go do another one. Let's go over to the jail. This is the temple. Miss Bill Keep. Over this way. And the jail is up on the right side. This is where we've been instructed to go talk to CB Blackbriar. We're gonna have to do a little arm twisting on the guard to get in. You there. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. Okay, I am on official business. I'm allowed to be here. Oh, my mistake then. Yeah. Sorry, you can Very go good. on ahead. Very good. Sibby. <laughs> uh -huh. You're in jail. Your mama threw you in jail, eh? <laughs> Ain't that a bitch. Okay. Have you come to gawk at me, or is this a social call? We came to gawk. Okay, now listen, I was sent by Louis the Trish. Ah, and let me guess. He, he wants, wants his, horse. his horse. That's right. Well, that's going to be a bit of a... That is correct. My plan was to take the horse... Okay, we don't still, care about your plan. We just want to, you know, twist your arm you what, and get some speech leveling. Steal the horse and deliver it, and you can have the second half of the payment. You know, I bet Maven would pay me even more for this information. Sure, take advantage of the guy in jail. Oh, don't mind okay, if I do. Fine, <laughs> I can make the deal sweeter. All right, next. While we're in the vicinity, let's find the back door to the Thieves Guild entrance. Thieves Guild entrance, rather. Which is right here next to the Temple of Mara. And you'll find a whole bunch of nightshade here. Eight to be exact. Exact. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Grab all those. And make sure that you have. About 10 salt pile. If you don't, you can go down to the, the docks here and check all the barrels, all the fish barrels. Always some salt pile here. That'll do. Next. <laughs> Talk about lazy slack. Yeah, a little lazy here. All right. Um, Let's go to, to the docks and find an individual named Wajita, an Argonian. 
He's got a skooma problem. Working for the fishery. She's dressed in a blue dress. There she is. Vegeta. Please help me. I'm going to lose my job at the Rifton Fishery. You might lose your job, eh? Okay. My job at the Rifton Fishery is in danger. The owner, Bolly, said that if I show up for work in this condition one more time, then I'm out. I don't mean to do this to myself, but I can't help it. I tried some skooma a year ago, and ever since then, I can't stop. If you could give me a healing potion, I could cleanse this poison from my body and get back to my life. Got that skooma monkey on your back. Okay, here you go. Here's a healing potion. Your kindness will never be forgotten. Here, take this. It's all I can offer you for what you've given me. A gold sapphire ring. <laughs> That's pretty good. Okay, let's now. Hey, we're not finished with you yet. Company. Uh, we want to know where do you get your skooma? Look, I don't think I should say. I mean, they could kill me. And is it good? Is it some good stuff? <laughs> no, I think you owe me one. Okay, okay I'll oh, tell you. Speech lovely. Yeah. I get my skooma from Sarthas Idrid. He has some sort of a setup over the Riften warehouse. You can't get inside though. They've kept that place locked up tight since the war began. Yeah, we'll see about that. Um, who has the key to the warehouse? I overheard Boldy say that only the Jarl carries the key to the warehouse. When I meet Sarthas there, he's usually waiting for me outside with his bodyguard. Okay. Well, You've we'll just kind. talk to I the Jarl. You. And if you didn't get enough salt pile... Now that we're friends with the doc, after having done Wujita a favor, you can loot all these fish barrels for some more salt oil, but we have enough, so yeah, all the barrels here are now Sorry, free. I'm afraid I can't help you much right. Well, let's go talk to the Arl at Miss Bell Keep. Come up with any information on these reports of dragons? Jarl, dude. Yes. Welcome to Riften, traveler. Uh, listen up, I've discovered a skooma dealer in Riften. It killed several soldiers. Yes, I'm afraid we're aware of Sarthus's presence in the warehouse. Oh, you are? Unfortunately, okay. we're certain he has informants within the city guard. Every time we've made a move to arrest him, he's escaped. Hmm. However, if you take care of this discreetly, you might be able to surprise him without warning. Okay. Sounds like fun. I'll do it. Excellent. Here, this is the key to the warehouse. Great. See if you can drop in on this dealer of poison and convince him to close down his operation permanently. Done and done. All right. I want I'm you to speak to the city. Remembered guard. exactly sure who I forgot to talk to. Maul. This is important because we need him down at the docks. Welcome to Riften, home of the thieves. Maul, my man. I don't so. know you. You and Riften looking for trouble? Of course. What do you come to Riften for? <laughs> no, just passing through. Yeah? Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see here. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. That's nice. You can level me up? Bri me? I'm Maul. Let me do a little arm twisting. Dirt? If Dirt? If you need dirt on I'm, not a, I'm not exactly I'm clean myself. Then we're speaking the same language. So what do you want to know? Okay, so that wasn't Same. enough to level up. Okay, so that's at any rate, um, this will move him from his current position down to the Riften docks, which is very important. And let's just wait till the next day to make sure he does that. Never done an honest Out of my face there, Brynjolf. We're not about the P skill this time. Back. Sorry. You make some coin? Come find me. There you go, there's Maul at his position there. And we've been instructed to enter the rift in the warehouse. Make sure you go in. Locked and loaded. Do a quick save before 
Okay, we're gonna go in, try to kill the first guy we see, and then immediately exit. This guy here. You can't hide from me. Down he goes, and then out you go. Yeah. I oh fuck. <laughs> okay, enter. Never should have come here. I hate that pause when you go through a door. It's just like. Mal, I'm I'm in deep shit here. Take care of those guys. Yeah, you guys need some help? I'm gonna crush you. Wait a minute, this guy's still alive. Okay, he's down. Must have scared him off. There we go. <laughs> That's why he's supposed to go down. And search Sarthist and get Sarthus's key. That's the most important thing. Let's grab all the rest of his stuff too. Uh huh. Maul spanked your ass. You too. And we can now go into the Riften warehouse. And we're only here for one thing. We don't really care about uh, doing this quest for the Jarl. We're just here for... Um, where is that door there? Right here. We have the key. <clears throat> and we're here for the moon sugar. There should be six of them here. One, two. And if you want to do the quest, look into the satchel. Grab the stuff here. Read shipments ready. The skooma recovers stamina, if I recall correctly. I rarely use it. Oh, wow. Recovers stamina with no penalty. Huh. Yeah, okay. Yeah, definitely grab that. That could be useful. Alright, okay, we're out of here. Alright, now, um, that's pretty much it. Like I said, we don't really want to do this quest for the girl. I don't think she really gives you anything significant for completing it either. And there's another objective afterwards, which will take us to Craig's Lane Cavern, which we're not going to do, definitely. I forget what happens when you complete this objective. I don't even think she rewards you with anything. Sarthus Idrid has been taken care of. It's nice to receive good news for a change. Did you recover anything else from the warehouse worth mentioning? Yeah, I discovered the source of the skooma. Then there's no time to Excuse lose. Me. <laughs> it won't take long for Sarthus' associates to learn of his death. The source of the poison must be destroyed once and for all. Definitely. Otherwise, another of course. dealer will simply take his place. Do this task for me, and you'll be well on your way to a title in Riften. I'll make sure it gets done. Good. Report back to me when your task is complete. Okay, like I thought. Like I thought, um, Good journey to you. you don't get anything for doing that. Alright, next. That's pretty much everything I wanted to do in Rift in, except for one last thing. Just check my ingredients here. Name stool. Canis root and oh, I forgot to bring the more tapanella. That's alright. Okay. Let us hire Mercurio. My, why hire a common soldier to protect you when you can have a master of the arcane? <laughs> 
A master of the arcane, okay. Hired. With a master of magic at your side, you'll have nothing to fear. No, of course. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Let's get going then. Divine oh, hang on. You, friend. I need to trade some things with you. I am an apprentice wizard, not a pack mule. Oh, very well, but make it quick. Well, that cuts it. You complain too much. Okay. You lead, I'll Come with me. <laughs> uh, now. Let's go to Windhelm for the second time. Very good. Next, let's go back to my headquarters in White Run. Come on, hustle it up here, Marcario. Let's see what I get for my 500 gold. It is, uh, oh. Are you open for business there, Adrian? Yes, you are. Clothes, you... Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Okay, we don't need any of this stuff. Oh, oh, don't sell that. We can afford to sell that, that, and the steel nerd gauntlets. Very good. Don't get to check inside the shop. If Feel a little heavy. Oh yeah, steel warhammer. Okay, we're good. It's all good. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. All right. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.